you got a microphone, you've got a fader, uh, and you got a speaker, and uh, and you all of all of mixing is manipulating those three things to get it to get things to sound the way you want them to sound, uh, and that's at that point all of the different uh, categories of mixing diverge because uh, that's where the similarity ends. Uh, when we do television, uh, television is like guerrilla audio. Uh, we have uh, uh, a very limited amount of time to do a lot of stuff, and there are a lot of people involved. When you're doing a record, you have uh, uh, an engineer, a producer, uh, maybe a few, a few hangers on hang, hanging around in the, in the control room, and you have the band, and you have an assistant. So it's a small group. They're all in one room, all focused. And, uh, and usually you have, uh, you, you, you have a schedule, but it's not a deadline. Uh, when you do this show, we have 120 people involved in this. They're spread out all over this building and um, uh, and everybody has a specific job and uh, uh, and when some people are doing their specific job we in audio are doing nothing so uh, we're basically sitting around waiting for them to do their to, to finish up so that we can do what we do and um, and it all comes crashing together around seven o'clock and uh, we just blow straight through a show unless there's a major train wreck, we don't stop. We have three different per performance areas here. We've got an area out in the back, full, a full performance concert stage. Uh, we have a, a, a smaller stage inside in our lobby, which is uh, uh, like a small club. And then we have our studio stage, which is even smaller. Um, the band, I, uh, I, I usually get an input list, uh, I get a copy of the song, uh, I look at the input list, uh, I, I see what their requirements are, uh, I try to make contact with the people from the band uh, so that we can get our ducks in a row. Um, some bands are endorsed by, certain, by a certain microphone manufacturer, so have to make sure that we're covered, that we have the microphones that we need, or if we don't, if they're you know, if they're okay with what we use. Uh, I have some I have some standard stuff that I like to use. Uh, uh, part of that is because um, I know what it'll do, I'm used to it. Uh, and, uh, but I'm not opposed to trying new things. In fact, I've learned, I've, uh, that's one, one of the things that I've found is that I, I is that if I'm, op if I stay open to this stuff, I, I uh, I learn a new trick every now and then, you know, and I like to have new tricks in my in my bag.